Welcome! Today we'll be going through question 1 from the USA JMO 2012. Given a triangle ABC, let P and Q be points on segments AB and AC, respectively, such that AP is equal to AQ. Let S and R be distinct points on segment BC, such that S lies between B and R, and angle BPS is equal to PRS and angle CQR is equal to angle QSR. Prove that P, Q, R and S all lie on the same circle. Please pause the video here and have a think about the problem on your own before proceeding to the hints and solutions. Hint number one. Consider the circumcircles of the triangles PSR and QSR. It is enough to prove that these circumcircles are the same. Hint number two. Consider the intersection of each circle with AS. Hint number three. Use the tangent second theorem. How would you show that AB and AC are tangents to the two circles? Solution. We will suppose that P, Q, R and S are not concyclic. Then if we draw the circumcircles of triangles PRS and QRS, they should be different. And because we know that they already intersect at R and S, they cannot intersect anywhere else. And so they must intersect the line AS at different points. Let them intersect AS it's x and y. Then considering the converse of the alternate segment theorem and the fact that angle BPS is equal to angle PRS, we see that AB is tangent to the first circle, the circumcircle of PSR. In the same way, we can find that AC is tangent to the second circle, the circumcircle of QRS. So now we can use the tangent second theorem by considering the two circles, the tangents AB and AC, and the line segment AS to get AP squared is equal to AY multiplied by AS and AQ squared equal to AX multiplied by AS. Now, from the question, we know that AP is equal to AQ, so we get AY multiplied by AS is equal to AX multiplied by AS. But we know that AS is equal to AS, so what we get is AY equals to AX. So X and Y are in fact the same point, since A, X and Y all lie on the line segment A, S, which means that the two circles are in fact the same because they intersect A, S at the same point. And so P, Q, R and S all lie in the same circle because the circumcircle of P, R, S and Q, R, S is the same. And hence we are done. Thank you for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed it, feel free to drop a comment in the comments down below and see you next time.